Nomicon. Buenos dias, Nerf Herders. It's Nerm here. With the foam brewer. And we're here today to do a little quick introduction to the Rival Flashlight Grip. Flashlight Grip, Rival, woo -hoo. So let's go over the box real quick, Nerf Herders. What we've got is the uh, the torch, the Rival Torch. Uh, it's die cast and it has an LED. Um, you know, we've heard from other reviews that the LED is not that powerful, but uh, we'll give it a try, you know. Uh, Detach I didn't know the grip was detachable. I don't think anyone else has talked about that. That's cool. So if you just want a flashlight, not a foregrip, you can do that too, huh? Yeah. Yes, foam brewer sets the knife down for safety. All right. Mm. So I'll take the flashlight portion, put some batteries in here. Go ahead and uh, pull that out. And it looks like our. Uh, so you're going to need a deepish number one screwdriver to open this thing up. And we got three AAA batteries on those. Negative, negative, positive. So we'll put the batteries in the torch. And put the cap back on. Actually, the... Uh, construction of this feels really nice I it's sad that people have said the torch is not that great hmm. yeah that's not that great it's I a single bulb so that's you know you can't expect too much out of it but for a single LED I mean I'm having trouble seeing after having shot it into my eyeball but uh, that means you can blind a zombie with it So it snaps together. Yeah, the construction is super rigid. Yeah, this is plastic, not die cast like the uh, some Flashlight. parts of this. Oh, I don't know how I feel about. Th nope, nope. There we go. Okay, that's pretty solid. Uh, the one thing I can see is it looks like the uh, the hand grip is actually really big, which is it cool. is. It's uh, you know, human size, not kid size. And that is important for us uh, humans. Should just be able to flip it on there. Flip it and clip it. Flip it and clip it, one would think. There we go. And wow. there we go. It is gigantic. A little bit of wobble, not too bad. Kind of gigantic, but not too bad. Nice and sturdy. Yep, a little wobble. But, uh, yeah, no, it's, uh, it's a little low, if anything, for the feel of having the torch over your hand. It puts your hand down pretty low. So, that is cool though, having the button right there at your thumb's disposal. Yeah, this product is, uh, you know, it's one of the best uh, foregrips, I do believe. I wonder if it fits on a Nerf rail. Probably uh, kind of fits on a Nerf that. rail the way that uh, the strife up there will work. There you go. The strife right here, Mr. Luke Goodman Strife. Ah. See, it's only gonna fit on the in the notches, right? The way that the uh, same way that the uh, red dot sight fits, which uh, which is kind of not really, kind of not really, and it has to be way forward. Okay, I have to be smarter than the product. That, that's that's starting out. So it uh, that's pretty goofy. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen goofier, but uh, yeah. Uh, Actually, it's more comfortable with the stripe because then you can just yeah. one hand your stripe and then pew 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 pew. So, uh, obviously, it won't fit in the back notch on a stripe because you uh, wouldn't fit. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't be able to access your torch. Other than how low it is, that's I like the the weight. It's nice and heavy, which usually wouldn't be a good thing on the front of your blaster. But since it's a foregrip, that actually kind of is okay for balance. And uh, the offset is, you know, if uh, you use this on a stripe like Darth Vader's with the uh, the heavy actual real real steel stock, mm -hmm. it would uh, make a nice counterbalance. Yeah, this is pretty sketchy to put on a Nerf rail. So, I wouldn't suggest that. Don't Otherwise, do that. Uh, yeah, pretty cool. All right, guys. Well, I think uh, what are we gonna give this product out of five? And I'll give it a four. Yeah, I would say about a four. for for. I don't particularly like to use 
four grips like that, but if I did, that's a fairly comfortable one. Yeah, and uh, like I said, the fact that it's man size is pretty awesome. Uh, I agree. All right, guys. Well, buenas noches, Nerf Herders. Cheers, Nerf Herders.